Hey there everyone, it's Helen. I'm the National Artist for Sephora Collection and if you are anything like me and you love to color treat your hair, you probably have run into the concern of brassiness. So brassiness can mean anything from like yellow or reddish golden color in your hair. It's usually a color that you don't really want there, was not originally supposed to be dyed that shade. I'm going to recommend some great products that I have used personally that really do help to get rid of that brass. Let's kick it off with the Color Wow Dream Filter Pre-Shampoo Mineral Remover. This is an incredible product. I don't know if you've ever noticed, but sometimes when your hair is wet, it looks like a little green, especially at the ends. I feel like I noticed that with my own hair. Chlorine can do this, um, but there's a heap of things that can kind of make your hair not just brassy, but just like off color, especially if you're blonde. So this is a great pre-shampoo treatment. Essentially, you just wanna saturate your whole head um, using this and you use it for about one to three minutes. I do the full three minutes because I just want to take out all of those mineral buildup that's in there. So it says that it removes copper, iron, magnesium, calcium, chlorine, and other elements. So I use this probably like towards the end of the life cycle of my blonde. Your hairstylist usually can make your hair look a little less discolored but this is a great kind of in between to hold it off and if you have like a chlorine pool this is a must you could use this even more frequently you could do it you know every week even just to keep that green out of your hair but i love this stuff it really does help to really clarify your hair color to really take the brass out of your hair while you're shampooing, you can use the Moroccan Oil Blonde Perfecting Purple Shampoo. This shampoo is great. It's a really rich tone of purple. So I even cut it sometimes with a regular shampoo to just lighten that up a little bit so I don't get the lavender tone in my hair. If your hair truly has some brass to it, you do need to leave it in for a little longer than a minute. I think it recommends like three to five minutes. I do like a quick run because I do this about once a week just to touch up the blonde. If you want to use it for three to five minutes, it might make your hair a tinge of purple, but it really does help to get rid of that brass. So the next time when you wash your hair without this, it will be super fresh, no brass. This is really great too because Purple shampoos can be very drying for the hair, but because it's from Moroccan oil, of course it has really hydrating ingredients in it, so that's why I love this one. It just really gives you that hydration and also gets rid of the brass. And next in the treatment zone is the Amica Buster Brass Cool Blonde Purple Intense Repair Hair Mask. So it's a mouthful, but this is a really great one as well. You can see this intense purple color. And this one you really do need to just coat your hair again three to five minutes. So very similar to the Moroccan oil. It just depends on what you wanna do. Amica recommends using this as just a mask that you want to use weekly. I would say you could even use it monthly. It really does kick that brass right out of your hair. It's amazing. It's something you want to use instead of like your purple shampoo or purple conditioner. This is just a really more of a treatment. So again, once a week in place of that, and then you can just go on through with your regular shampoo and conditioner, and that will really kind of balance everything out. Again, because it's a mask, it's going to be a little bit hydrating as well. So that's always a big plus when it comes to anything that's like an intense purple. Usually those are a little bit more drying. So this is a really great way to sort of have the best of all the worlds. And the next thing that I really do love is the Orbe Bright Blonde Essential Priming Hair Serum. So this is great because it is not an intense purple color. It is something that you can use every single day. It's a hair serum. It has brightening qualities to it, so it has this like sparkle to it that really gives your hair extra shine. Um, but you can see it's more of like a lavender tone. It's not as deep as like a conditioner um, or a mask or a shampoo that you would use in the shower, those you traditionally wanna wash out, whereas this is something you can just kind of run through your damp hair. It also has heat protecting in it, so it's really great if you style your hair afterwards, it's really gonna protect your hair. I just really like it, it's great for anybody who has a little bit of brassiness in their hair. 
And if you have hay hair like mine, you're going to want to try this Kerastase Blonde Absolute Strengthening Hair Oil for very damaged blonde hair. That's truly the name of the product and it really does work. I use this actually as like the very final step after my hair is dry. You can use it in damp hair, you can use it in dry hair. My hair is kind of straw-like texture, so it absorbs oil really quickly. It's great for if you have flyaways. This doesn't necessarily get rid of brass, but it really does help if you have color treated hair to help to hydrate it again. I feel like when you're using any of the, you know, mineral removing products or anything that has purple in it, it's drying and this is going to help to really rehydrate your hair and give it that like soft, silky texture and so much shine. And I just feel like for moisturizing, you cannot go wrong with this. It's gonna keep your hair in top condition. I can't recommend it enough. Not only do these products send brassiness packing, but they're also really nurturing for your hair. So I would love to hear from you which products you've used to keep your hair super fresh. And if you liked this video, be sure to like and subscribe. And until next time, bye everyone.